Hello everybody, welcome back, and here's part two of the Hot Wheels Turbo Racing Race. So if everyone's ready, we're gonna go on one, three, two, one. All right, back in action. That's right. So the first bit of Heli Crash for me wasn't particularly my strong suit, because I think I chose the wrong view. I admittedly chose the wrong vehicle for this. I should have reminded myself of the stats of each vehicle before I started. Oh well. It's no big deal. All that matters is I'm still winning this race and that I'm in currently, so. You're probably on what, lap four, lap five of Just started race? lap five. I just started lap three, I'm two behind. Oh, get off the wall. <laughs> I just... I may or may not have just blown up another car by running into it head-on at 180. Hmm. Yeah, catapult just exploded when I touched it. <sighs> Barely able to get the double... Barely able to get a double there. Yeah, I really should have chosen something else. Like, I completely forgot that this thing is not a stunt vehicle, which which is weird considering the, uh, the titch, it's, a, it's, you know, the main co cover vehicle for a game that's about stunt track driving. And even then, it's a starter vehicle in that game, and it's not the best. Like, it's still a little a more capable since. Still a little more capable stunts in that game than it is here, though. Well, that's because every car in that game has the same stunt stat. Big. I know, exactly. And that reminds me, just this week it was accidentally leaked on the Microsoft Store that there is a Hot Wheels game coming out this year. Yeah, by Milestone, Milestone. or something. Which, you know, they make good arcade handling physics, which is what Hot Wheels is all about, so... Yeah. And I've heard it's got a livery creator. I'm not sure if it has a track editor, but I believe it's supposed to. If it if it does not have a track editor, that's a gr that would be a greatly missed opportunity. Okay, round five. Race five. All right, cool. That's that. That's hella crash. That is hella my chopper done. Hella my chopper. Yep. Put the cookie down. Get to the chopper. Yeah, my voice is a Right, bitch. after what happened, I think I'm not going to make the same mistake by using that vehicle again. I'm going to just quickly look at a vehicle that I know has good stunts. Ah, yes. The sh Despite its low durability, the shadow jet should be good for this. Good speed, good stunts. Very good control. I know doing that cost me a little bit of time, but I just needed to. It's been a while since I've memorized all the vehicles in this, so. Oh, this feels so much more acrobatic. Should have just used this before. Oh well. You know, I think I've actually seen on some, uh, like, bases of the stealth model, of the stealth car. Uh, I've seen it marketed, like, in on, like, pa actual Hot Wheels packaging. It's like Shadow Jet Mark II. Shadow Jet II is the, is actually the most common name for that car. It was only called stealth in a couple, for a couple castings. In fact, they called it stealth... For, for th those couple castings, then went back to the Shadow Jet 2 name. Hot Wheels are castings are, can be weird sometimes. Well, that was like, you know, Hot Wheels castings have always been weird, but that was the '90s too. The last several, the last several years, if anything, has been taunting, teaching us. They've been, they've been daring to be a little more crazy again, but they also have been, they. They've been giving some of the most, most unique real real car castings that they've ever given us. 
and the fact that they've also incorporated the Hot Wheels Legends Tour winners in the main line. That's yeah. also pretty big. Speaking of Hot Wheels Legends Tour winners, uh, coming soon to Forza Horizon 4, the Hot Wheels Car Pack. Yeah, which includes two of the winning Legends cars. Yep, the 2018 winner 2 Jet Z and 2019 And then the, the Nash. Nash Metropolitan. The, the, the Firebird or whatever, that one 2020 is not in there. Probably because they didn't have time to model it. Yeah, I unlocked the Super Band. I'm going to go use Shadow Jet for this one. Oh, you're taking my idea. Yeah. Because, like, normally I'd be using Rockbuster, but I didn't unlock Rockbuster, so. Which one do you even... I don't even remember which event gets you Rockbuster. It's one of the desert tracks. I do know that much. So is it, like, the first one? It's either Dawn Encounter or uh, Road to Rustwell, if I remember correctly. Cause, cause, okay. Again, again, it's been such a while since I played this. Uh, my memory on what you get on some of these has been long since gone. Yeah, I would have had a advantage if I knew that and just went for Rockbuster, but I didn't want to do that. Could go for one of the easier ones to get in Snake River Mine, but nah. Like, I think the only way that I can catch up now is if you miss checkpoints somehow, which I don't think is going to happen. I don't. I I'd be amazed if I could. I'd be amazed if I could actually do that. I've seen it happen. Oh, I'm not. I know it's possible. It's just like I said. I would be surprised if I did that. That minecart is deadly, but that mystery car is not worth it. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's been higher. What are you telling me to stay on, Mr. Texas announcer? You told me to stay on it. I mean, that's what you should be doing. What am I staying on, though? The road, the grab, stay on the throttle, the go fast button. But he said that after I did a stunt. Well, stay on it. <laughs> what else do you need? I don't know. A notarized document, I guess. A seal of approval saying, hey, do this. Why would you need a seal of approval in a Hot Wheels game? Seriously, know. why would you? Besides, besides, documents are boring. I did not even intend to go that way, but the game took me that way. Oops. I mean, whatever you say, I guess, game. Not getting any turbos for 50,000 barrel rolls, yeah! Oh, no, damn it. Screwed that up. All those potential boosts I could have got gone. Did you also not get turbos? Ah, oh, damn rolls? it, I did it, and I did it twice in a row. Two times in a row. Yeah, cool. Thanks uh, for giving me the gyro, the uh, gyrometer. Uh, all right, screw it. We'll just do a helicopter. Just to kind of make up for that. A 540 a helicopter bit. or a 720 helicopter? Yes. 
Oh. Maybe we'll go in the middle. How did I manage a, that? Maybe it was a 630 helicopter. It doesn't matter. Alright, there we go. I Avoid the wheels of destroying this. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, I know. Oh, okay. I gotta press start. Yep, yep. New cup. Secret car cup where there's only two events. Try the bisector for the first event. For sludge works. Ah, uh, yes, the longer of the two tracks. Yep. Are. That's also where there's more in the future. Hint, hint. Ow. The wheels broke me. The wheels broke me twice. The wheels rejected you. They weren't hot enough. <laughs> no, they weren't on fire. Nor were they powerful. Or of power. No. Oh, come on. Oh, Jesus. You all right there? Hey, I wanted to to be like, what's up? Up, oh, I just saw a car die because of the wheels, and then in my witnessing a car dying because of the wheels, I died because of the wheels. That's wheelie bad. Yeah, I was a lap ahead of sixth place, Sweet 16 too. I have mad skills. Skills. Bisector, go kart, road rocket. Yep. I've never really used a bisector much before, so I wanted to use it for this. That mixture of European. Mind the hidden games. tracks. Win the Hot Wheels Cup Series to unlock secret tracks. Find the hidden tracks. Win the Hot Wheels Cup Series to unlock secret tracks. Oh yeah! Macho Man Randy Savage wants to unlock some hidden tracks. I mean, sure. <laughs> we'll go with that. Oh, oh no. Get in there. There we go. Yeah, I decided to use uh, Road Rocket for RM Sludgeworks. In the seat Fair enough. Up. Jeez. Oh, 
guess I'm not taking the secret that would launch me into the tubes of goo. The goo tubes. Oh, split and image two is ahead of me. I need to change that. Ah, those rolling rocks really get me. Here. Yep. The wheels, they break you. Yeah. Yeah. It's like it's like when uh, like Chaco Mountain oh, in Mario on. Kart 64 that has those rolling rocks. Yep. I'm guessing you're not a fan of rolling of rolling rock beer then. I don't drink beer. I'm I might I'm all, I'm just kind of making a joke about the beer named Rolling Rock. Eat that's, beer. I mean, as long as you're not using the rolling the rolling. <laughs> As long as you're not drinking Rolling Rock on the Rolling Rocker. Or Rock? Rock. Sure. Whatever you say, James Rolf. No, the Rock? Rock. That came from a YouTube poop. I can't remember which one. I know. I know. I, I remember that. Okay, I did not realize I could hit that fast enough to where I could actually hit the top of it. Now I know. Oh, I almost ran into another car. Mid-air, in the cross-section. If NASCAR what? Rumble came to the Nintendo 64, yeah, would have would have uh, probably worked on the the higher yeah, yeah, I mean, console, but I, it didn't I've happen. never heard of it much, but uh, okay. NASCAR Rumble is—it's basically it's like Mario Kart, but with NASCARs and all right. never really going ovals. It's all, all on, right. like second uh, track. I'm gonna use the road rocket for this one. Losing it. But uh, NASCAR Rumble, which is another Electronic Arts game, uh, back when they actually made good games and not just the same sports games every year. And then not just give us your money simulator. Uh, they made, uh, you know, they were the pioneers of the NASCAR Thunder series, which is great, uh, but... NAS uh, NASCAR Rumble and then its sequel, Rumble Racing, are very much arcade-style, like, kart racer-type games. But with NASCAR Rumble having, you know, the likes of Dale Earnhardt and other NASCAR legends at the time. And it's really fun! It's a shame it was a PlayStation exclusive, though, but then again, so is, uh, so the need for speed titles of the day. Because, yeah, you could fit a lot more on a PlayStation disc than you could a Nintendo 64 cartridge. About 800 megabytes of data versus 64. Oh. Uh-oh. I gotta hit the rear... Hmm. Yeah. 
No, I do not. I'm not, I do not need these brakes, but thank you, anyways. Oh, you're you were about to drive into the munchers, weren't you? No. Oh. I don't. It's very rare that I've ever done that. Hey, you know what? Let's go with the go kart. It's not gonna be fast, but on a track where it says stunt, I'm gonna stunt. Yeah, you're gonna get Wait, are a lot. The go kart. Are you guys is... doing the bonus tracks? Yeah, we're doing yeah, the secret car cup already. That's the next cup you will unlock. And then I won't after get, that. Well, I won't get to see that. Eh, you will in editing. <laughs> well, that too. Well, that's true. That there, there is a password that you can put in to unlock everything. But where's the fun in that? Oh boy, there split loop. That was the section I wanted to go up. That's that's better for this vehicle. Oh, were you talking about one of the ramps or you t Oh, I the end the section before the finish line, I know. Yeah. Cuz the road rocket's not four wheel drive. There we go. At least that at least counted. Oops, I I managed to go into one of the secret areas, to grab a mystery car. Oops. You really are trying to get a lot of those mystery cars, aren't you? I This one was inadvertent. <laughs> Fair enough. The only one that I actually went out of my way to grab was the one in uh, Helicrash, which unlocked the super yeah, that's, van. Yeah, that's, that's the van. Yeah, I rem that one I remember. E I always remember because it's the easiest one to get. Or one of the easiest to get. I mean, the one in RM Test Tracks. Because uh, I believe there's only one on this track, actually. Yeah, I believe so. It's in that, you know, where that's, it's kind of that slalom area, but there's breakable walls. And breakable pillars, for that matter, but you gotta be careful with those. How many laps in are you, uh, Thunder? Five. Five? Yeah, I'm on lap two. So that means Thunder's in the lead right now. Yeah, Threats. uh... Something I've just realized, I thought about. I think this whole time I've never pressed the Z button so I could do like the the barrel rolls. Oh yeah, the handbrake button. Because the thing is, I don't actually know which button I've assigned to on my controller. Oh, I think I figured out. It, uh, yeah, I figured. Yeah, I figured it out. I didn't mean to do that, but whatever. At least that gave me some turbos to kind of make up for that. You know what you should do, Thunder? I know one of the cars that's uh, that you unlock is the dragster. You should use that for the twin mill challenge. That'll totally work. No. <laughs> What do you think, I am a lunatic? Maybe. I don't know. I mean, I know Turbo Carl's calls me the car crazy Canadian, but I think he means the fact that I'm crazy about cars, not the fact that I'm uh, crazy. A crazy though, maybe that, though maybe that also might partially be why. I'll have to talk to him. I'll have to ask him about that. But, uh... Yeah, by the time you get started with the Twin Mill Cup, and by the time, like, the 30-minute marker rolls around, you'll be uh, probably on, like, lap 4. So, it wouldn't necessarily make sense to be that close to the end of, the, of like, the overall race to call apart. Right. Yeah. Yes, just, yes, yes. It Mad makes skills. logistical sense. All right, last oh, fourth thing to place do, in that place. Last thing to do the twin mill challenge. That was a tough. That and was a tough. Because the game one. actually lets you use the twin mills. I'm obviously using that. to use the twin mill too. Ooh, you can use the one that gets no representation in video games. The one that, the one that's even forgotten by Hot Wheels Damn. themselves these days. 
Yeah, because they'll re-release Twin Mill 3. Alright. And Twin Mill 1. Show off that road not Twin Mill 2. Well track. It's it said Twin Mill 1, Twin Mill 3, and that Twin Mill Gen oh. E1 oh. or oh. whatever. Twin Mill 2 is just okay, a forgotten or relic. Or, no, I guess I'll do... Alright, we got five minutes left. You have well, you I'm on the last know? event, so... Yeah, and by the time the 30-minute timer is up, he'll be pretty far into the last event. Uh, I know you... Yep. Like, I know like you want to keep that 30 minute mark you know kind of regimented but i mean it wouldn't it, like make it would make logistical sense to have part a three would be way too short yeah okay so so all right so so you guys are both on the last track now uh i'm I almost am. on the last track okay then we'll go until either one oh or God, both of you beats on, it then. yep Hey, I've gone to the Hot Wheels Cup at least once so far and lost, of course, as expected. Hey, it's about trying new things. Don't beat yourself up too much. I mean, for me and RKD, we've played this game before, so there is a yeah, sense of familiarity. We've kind of, we've kind you, of you'll get this game. once you play. It's that's kind of how it is. You just when you play a game, you just you get used, you get the feel for it, and that's. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with you know yeah. trying to play something for the first time. Mm -hmm. I mean, to be fair, I kind of basically went in blind for the Revolt race, and I'm surprised I did as well as I did. All right, so uh, so Thunder, since this was official, you're gonna you're gonna get a pick for this one. Well, if if the way this is going so far is is any is the case, yeah. Keep in I, mind, I gotta actually still gotta actually finish the event. Well, world, there's only three people here, so and this way and this was RKD's pick, so that you automatically get I, a pick. Oh yeah, yeah. That's, that is that is true. Great now, great now, I gotta think about what I have to choose again. Thinking hurts. Thinking is hard. My brain cells light themselves on fire whenever I have to use my brain. Hot Wheels 500, Twin Mill, Twin Mill 2, Twin Mill Challenge. Ooh, that was close. Now I just get to start the Twin Mail Challenge. How many laps in are you, Thunder? Four. Yeah, you got this. And I, I wouldn't chose Twin Mail 1 because... You chose to end meal too. For they're a they're both game. they both drive the same, so yep. from my understanding. Yeah, they have the same. There's, re there's really no difference. It just depends on which one you like you like the look of more. Mm -hmm. Well, I know the twin mill two is blue, and blue is kind of your color. Oh, a little too far ahead for that. Oh well, don't need it. Don't need it that way. Oh, I got dumped. You got dumped like Kyle Busch in Richmond 2016. When Carl Edwards dumped him in the final turn. Well, I mean, the Texas announcer also says, Dump it and bump it. Mm-hmm. So now you just need to be bumped as well. All right, I could just—I could obviously just do the strip, but 
I think I'm more interested in uh, just taking it from ability. Yeah. You on the sixth lap or? Final lap, yep. Up, oh, that means we're almost done then. Well, unfortunately, I was not able to dump him back, but I'm back in the lead. New leader, Thunder, come on. And done. All right. All right. Congratulations, Thunder. Thunder, you won the race. And RKD, uh, you hey, uh, one day uh, you're on the same track too, right? Uh, yes, yep, I am is. indeed on the same track. I'm on lap three. <laughs> okay, then what? Well, uh, what? Well, let's go. Let's uh, let's go until you finish, and, and then we'll then we'll then we'll then call we'll, it. Then we'll, yeah, then we'll call it there. All right. There you go. There's all the extra vehicles. And you get to show off the cars. I assume you didn't get pushed into the uh, the spinny blade uh, pit. There was uh, just there was a works. there was just a situation where like I got dumped by the the, the other twin mill two driver. So last couple laps, I was just trying to get back. Yeah, it happens. It's fine. Doesn't matter. It's interesting how they give the twin mill two a, the twin mills a kind of a average stunt stat. When honestly, it's the stunt it, the its ability stunt ability is better than the game says. Personally, it's not like it's like it's not the outright best. The go kart's the outright best, oh, yeah. but Also, I should mention, because my footage is mostly kind of 4x3 gold, do you need me to cut out the black bars before sending it, the footage? No, I, I, I'll, I think I'll, oh, you mean the one, you mean the borders? Yeah, the black oh, I can borders. Do that. I can do that in editing. All right. Because I will have to put, the, I will have to put these to the editor so that I can shrink the file size down a bit. Just depend, and also 1080 or 720. 720 uh, should be fine. Yeah. Alright. Because, I mean, what's the difference between 720 and 1080 for a Nintendo 64 game? Also, to be fair, the screens will be shrunken up to fit all three on screen, so... Yep. Actually, since I'm still waiting here, I'm going to... I'm gonna go back to the twin belt challenge, but I'm gonna use the rock buster. No, oh, I exploded! Come on, come on, game! Oh, you, you're not gonna give me the compressor either. Cool, cool, cool. I'm on lap six. I'm not gonna win the twin belt challenge, unfortunately. I'm too far behind. Okay, well at least I finished this race by actually winning a track. Hey, hey! Oh my god! But I'm I'm almost done with the race. Yeah, the Twin Mill Challenge is difficult. You really gotta hit it, your marks. It's also just the fact that the Twin Mills are like the best cars in the game and both the AI used and the race use them. That's what I said, you should've used the Dragster. It's all speed. Yeah, but it's not much else. He's gotta be hit by the spinny blade wall. Nope, that won't be enough. Up, oh, he fell into the masher anyway, but I'm twin mill challenge over. All right, that's it. Congratulations to Thunder, you've won the race. And uh, coming up next on our list is going to be a Pokemon puzzle challenge, which uh, which I believe a uh, Silver Wolf picked. So uh, correct. So uh, we'll just keep a heads up for that, and we'll see you for the next race. Later, folks. I'll take care out there.